So as you start to create sales, WooCommerce is going to give you a ton of information. One of the best ways to make sense of all that data is in reports. Head over to WooCommerce and click on reports. So this is going to give you just a great overview of all of the stats on your store, including coupons, refunds, number of items, orders placed, etc., etc. And as you scroll over here on the left, each of those lines is highlighted over on the right. If I make that just a little bit smaller so you can see the whole screen, you'll see what that looks like. And that can be really helpful. So this, of course, is the orders screen. If we click on customers here at the top, of course, I've only got one customer, and that's me at this point, but you'll see all kinds of information here, customer sales versus guest sales. If I click on stock, it's going to show me what I have and do not have in stock. Of course, I haven't added stock levels in on my products. If you do, you can easily manage your stock right here on this screen. And then the taxes tab allows me to see how much in taxes I've collected overall. If I click on this month, it's going to give me the taxes from all the sales I made for the last video. This is a hugely helpful report, and of course you can export it as a CSV and give to your accountant. The reports in WooCommerce are a really good starting point, but if you want to learn more about your customers and where they come from, we recommend looking at your Google Analytics. If you're not using Google Analytics on your store or on your site, you really should be. Head over to analytics.google.com, sign up, and get it done. There's a great plugin that will install the code on your site. The analytics tools from Google are far more powerful and can track the traffic on your site in a much better way. If you're new to Google Analytics, well, there's a great class for OS training, OSTraining.com slash class slash Google dash analytics. If you want some WooCommerce specific analytics, try Metoric.com which was started by a former employee of Automatic who owns WooCommerce. It provides more powerful reports than WooCommerce Core, and you can get those reports emailed to you regularly. It offers the ability to drill down into your data and analyze specific groups of orders, customers, or products. We highly recommend it. Again, the reports in WooCommerce are a great place to start, but if you're really serious about learning about your customers, these are two options that you can add. In the next video, we're going to talk about managing your inventory.